ざと上旬に攻めた So good.
<laughs> Don't rush. Take your time. Is that all? Thanks for your patronage. to lead the expedition against Joshua. What do you intend to do, Saito? Well, I'll leave you to ponder it. Some solitude may bring you clarity. the Shogun's direct orders. Preposterous. There is nothing I can do. Forget the Shogunate. I want to speak to you, not them. It was the Choshu who drew their swords first. And considering their behavior in Kyoto, how can we leave them be? Look, I understand Satsuma's perspective. Mm. But, have you thought about our future? What do you mean? Hmm. You have... 
have to. If Satsuma and Choshu join forces, there'll be nothing to fear. Your alliance will be the bedrock of a new Japan. You want us to march alongside our sworn enemies? I simply cannot see it. And yet, it can be so. If we should will it. But first, I should apologize. I am sorry. I could not stop the conflict earlier. <gasps> Katsura of the Choshu? What are you wearing? Oh, ignore these filthy rags. I assure you, my aspirations remain unsullied. As my associates have said, we must put aside our differences. Even if it means moving heaven and earth, we must transform Japan. Katsura, I... I hear you. I accept your proposal. <clears throat> Gesho, too, would have been glad to put an end to the bloodshed. Then it's settled. The Choshu and Sasuma will join forces, and we shall be the ones to see it through. You know, I've heard that in the West you're meant to hold hands and shake them on occasions like this. Go on. Try it. <sighs> Sego, I look forward to working with you. Pleasure is mine. Takamori Saigo, swayed by Ryoma, defies the Shogun's orders and calls off the Satsuma assault on the Choshu. This episode helps the Satsuma and Choshu draw closer, and they conclude an alliance aimed at overthrowing the Shogunate. <laughs> Don't you remember what I told you back then? That I had a dream as big as the damn ocean! <laughs> <laughs> This way. Okay, plan. Ah, this is a real mess. <laughs> After being attacked at the Terada Inn, Ryoma Sakamoto took refuge amongst the Satsuma clan. 
Might not be so lucky next time. I'm going to have to leave things to you for now. I'm counting on you. Did the Ryoma make it away without any trouble? I'm sorry I couldn't be there for the send-off. Now we can't afford to ignore what happened at the Tarada Inn. But we still don't know the true course of events. Indeed. From what you've said, we can be sure a Shinsengumi member was involved. Kondo and Hichikata were away from Kyoto, serving the Shogunate, which puts both of them out of the picture as suspects. If the Satsuma Choshu Alliance searches for the culprit in the open, we'll only incur the wrath of the Shogunate. And that's where you come in. We want you to infiltrate the Shinsengumi and sniff out the culprit from within. I leave the matter to Katsura's judgment. I knew you'd be on board with the idea. You can handle yourself and adapt to the unexpected. And since you were once part of their number, even fleetingly, you shouldn't raise suspicion. Well, perhaps some of them already know of you, but with a little disguise, no one will notice, I'm sure. You can learn from me. Come to Nishi Honganji Temple once you're fully prepared. You need to be ready to pass the initiation. This place is being used as a Shinsengumi outpost. The arrangements for enlisting have already been made. Thanks to a Satsuma connection, they're expecting a skilled Ronin to join their ranks. I've arranged for a uniform for you as well. You'll easily pass for the rank and file. Unless you can uncover who orchestrated the attack on the Tareda Inn, it won't be safe for Ryoma to come back. I know you're up to the task. The stakes are high, but I'm counting on you. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Saigo and I will be praying for your good fortune. Ah, you must be the new recruit. I've heard much about you. I've heard talk of your skill with the sword. But a lot of the men here like to talk big, so I'll have to see it to believe it. Hmm? 
Have I seen you someplace? Now there's a fearsome look. Uh, I expect great things from you. Though I swear I know you from somewhere. <laughs> I didn't mean anything by it. I apologize. Ah, I haven't introduced myself, Shinpachi Nagakura. And this cold fish is Hajima Saito. Saito? Show the new recruit around our outpost, and make sure you put them through their paces. Make sure you listen to Saito's every word, you hear? His skill is peerless. <laughs> Don't upset him or you're done for. <laughs> Good grief. Never. Dueling is strictly forbidden in the organization. Kill another member and you'll be made to turn that sword on yourself. The training facilities are just over there. Let's head in. Ah, that Suzuki. Here's where we train. Seems we're just in time for a session. You won't make it into the Shinsengumi without some skill at the sword. It's time to show me what you're worth. Try taking him on. Good, I have high hopes. to see a little more. Now, I'd like you to face him. Don't disappoint me. Kakugo! They've got what it takes? The technique is certainly interesting. Not bad at all. Well, coming from you, I'll take that as a high compliment. Now, what say I grant them the honor of a bout with their superior? Nagakura is in a different league from the other members you fought. Fancy your chances? Haha! <laughs> Don't you worry. No one's going to die. No need to hold back. Throw everything at me. Oh! 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 
I yield! <laughs> You're no joke. Most intriguing. Best thing Nagakura is no mean feat. Right then, follow me. Ah, you must be the newcomer. Could you come here a moment? Sorry for interrupting. But even in this state, I thought I should at least introduce myself. This is Soji Okida. Neither I nor Nagakura are his match in swordplay. That's all in the past now. Now that I'm bedridden, I don't amount to anything but dead weight. If you want to improve, Saito could teach a thing or two, I'm sure. He's peerless, after all. <laughs> <coughs> Okita, I'll go on to the dojo. Send the new recruit over once you finish talking. So then, why do you want to join the Shinsengumi? Well... Oh. So you consider yourself quite capable, then? I would love to have faced you. But you can see my difficulty. <coughs> By the way, haven't I met you somewhere before? I seem to recall meeting someone rather like you. I don't know why you've come here. But I'd take care not to draw too much attention if I were you. Your life's at stake. Saito's waiting, isn't he? You should get going. I'll see you later. Let's begin.
you're strong, that's for sure. There are few amongst our number who would be a match for you. That is no exaggeration. Why? You could go toe to toe with Kogoro Katsura or Ryoma Sakamoto. Those names must have reached your ears, I'm sure. Hmm. Fine words. I hope to see you live up to them in battle. Right. I think we can make use of the new recruit. Any objections? Not from me. There's someone else I'd like to introduce you to. Follow me. There's an officer I'd like you to meet, Kashitaro Ito. A man so sharp he can tell you where the world is going and exactly how it's going to get there. Suzuki, I pointed him out before, is Ito's younger brother. He's important to know too, leads one of our units. Now, after I introduce you to Ito, I'll speak with him in private. You are to use any means necessary to listen to our conversation. Understood? Ito, I've brought you a new recruit. Their swordsmanship rivals that of myself or Nagakura. Well, you must truly be something to earn such praise from Saito. I am Kashitaro Ito, Shinsengumi's staff officer. The Shinsengumi is made up of the most elite warriors in Japan. Against the Shogun's cowardly retainers, we are as a tiger to a house cat. This country's very future will be decided by our actions. You would do well to be mindful of the power we wield. <laughs> A most promising recruit. By all means, put that sword arm to use in service of our cause. I expect great things from you. By the way, Saito, can I have a word with you? That will be all. Dismissed. Listen to our conversation from outside. And make note of every word. Got that? Go. I was just asking the newcomer to train the men. Someone so skilled should be able to oversee fencing drills, I thought. With Kondo and Hijikata Axe and Okita Ailu, now's the time. No one can stop us from breaking away from the Shinsengumi. But without us here, the enemies of the Shogunate lurking in Kyoto may grow bold. The attempt on Sakamoto at the Terada Inn failed to rouse either the Satsuma or the Choshu. We needn't worry on that account. We are gathering in Aburana Koji to discuss precisely how to break free. I expect to see you there. We are finished. You can come out now. Fine work playing the spy. I doubt Ito noticed a thing. You must have heard it yourself, but let me state, Ito is a traitor. I'm keeping watch over him at Kondo's orders.
It's mostly the Choshu. There's a rumor they're joining forces with the Satsuma, though. And it was Sakamoto who brokered the deal. He recently became a bigwig in the anti-shogunate forces, prompting Ito's attempt to off him at the Terada Inn. Well, even if we did, we wouldn't just boorishly try to overwhelm him with numbers. If we wanted him dead, I alone would have sufficed. Ito's true intent was to tarnish the Shinsengumi's reputation and to ascertain the plans of the anti-shogunate forces. What we learned is that they can't afford to make any big moves right now, which led to Ito concluding the time was right for him to make his move. I'm going to rid the Shinsengumi of Ito's faction. I know you've only just enlisted, but I will need your help. Meet me at Abura no Koji. That's where we'll do it. Have a browse. <laughs> hmm. You look like you have some skill. I have a favor to ask of you. A hulking man calling himself Benke has been appearing on Gojo Bridge at night. He attacks every samurai he sees and claims the arms and armor of those he's beaten. Did you have to say it out loud? My reputation would suffer if this were to become public knowledge. That's why I'm seeking help in a place like this. If you can defeat that man and recover my possessions, you'll be well rewarded. Excellent. Now I'd thank you to see to it promptly. Just take care to be discreet. Don't breathe a word of this to a single soul or bring anyone with you. Give me here! All those who are nigh, bear witness. Benke is my name. Come! Who dares to battle with me? You dare, champion! Take us!
Earth interrupt. You there, just lend me your blade. Somewhat rashly, and yet I regret that thing.
Oh, it's you. You came. We'll begin once Ito's men are here. This is your first official mission. Is there anything you need to ask? Good. That saves me some trouble. Tordor and his companions are masters of the sword. This will be quite the fight. Are you fully prepared? Good. We'll ambush them as they return. They're coming. Quickly, hide. The deception has gone both ways. Please don't take it personally. <laughs> <laughs> in battle, and in door. We can strive for a world free of conflict and bloodshed. <laughs> <laughs>
You'd fight like a madman to protect your brother. Rather than face him head on. Perhaps we should strike from the roof. So you can't. But you never reach my brother! Your time. Is that all? Thanks for your patronage. Think you outwitting me, do you? Ha! It's you who have me coiled. I will meet out your punishment. You're just another samurai who can't record the past.
purpose. He only prays at being a samurai. Why can't you see it for the boss he is? Oh, <laughs> 